Hello and welcome to Adam and Craig Do Stuff where today we are doing Who Zoo and Dinosaur World. Who Farm has now become Who Zoo and Dinosaur Kingdom. So they've added 15 animatronic dinosaurs. So we're here to check that out. And of course, it's a bank holiday in England, so it is throwing it down. So right. it's absolutely horrendous, <laughs> isn't it? It's yeah. Disgusting. So it's still very busy. Still lots of people here. Yeah. And uh, you might be able to hear the dinosaurs in the background now. Um, but. Uh, now if you watched our last vlog you will know that we were supposed to be at Hamilton um, in between this and the last vlog that we did but due to some car troubles we've had to reschedule that because we couldn't make it so that vlog is still coming uh, yeah. in the next coming weeks uh, along with our Paltons part vlog as well um, which is coming up in the next couple of days. Allosaurus here is having some sort of standoff with the Stegosaurus. I think she's probably protecting her little babies there. They're looking pretty good though, aren't they? Mm. Yeah. Very noisy, they're very vocal dinosaurs all yeah. the way through. One thing in comparison to like when you go to the dinosaurs at like Blackpool and West Midlands is they only move and talk very periodically, don't they? There's yeah. quite a long gap where they're just not doing anything, whereas these um, they always they always seem to be moving and, and making noise mm. so you don't have to sort of wait around for them to do as you can hear behind us yeah um, so yeah I like that it, it, there's, there's always at least one dinosaur in each scene that seems to be active at, at one time which is good I like that rather yeah. than waiting because at West Midlands you can wait you can wait what, for what seems like quite a long time can't you in between mm. yeah in and between sometimes you moving. can easily not know that they're moving yeah yeah yeah, yeah. And then if they're broken and they're not moving, you wouldn't even know. You could be stood there for ages. Yeah. I think they're a lot better than they expected here, actually, the dinosaurs. Yeah, yeah. Mm. For saying it's such a small park, yeah. I can't imagine there's a huge budget for this sort of thing. But, yeah, they're really good-looking dinosaurs. Um, and they've got some special stuff going on. There's someone walking around in a Velociraptor costume. And they've got some photo opportunities as well, haven't they? Which we'll mm. probably go check out um, yeah. a little bit later on. And that bit's indoors, so, you know, out of the room.
that was a little um, tour around the Jurassic World, um, which is right at the back of the park. Very, very impressed with that. They're really, mm. really good animatronics there. Um, and there's that little last section where they've got some ponds and some water features. That was really nice. Did you enjoy that? I did, yeah. Oh, and there's a little mm. fossil dig here, look, uh, oh, which we probably yeah. won't be doing. But if you've got the kids, just spin the camera around. Can you see that? Oh, there we go. I'm not really sure what I'm uncovering, um, but there's something there, look. Clean out his eyes, stop it. Is that his eyes? Oh, no, hang on. Oh, <laughs> it says maximum age 12 years old. I think you're a little bit too old for, for that, Greg. Does it? <laughs> it does there on the sign. We'll not tell anyone. <laughs> So we've done the uh, dinosaurs, so let's go and see if we can see some animals. <laughs> I'm not sure how well we will see them today because the weather being as it is, um, the deer, they're already hiding in the trees and to be fair, I don't really blame the animals if they want to stay under covers. Um, we're at the wolves now, so hopefully we will see them about. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's behind me. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I didn't even notice. Hello. Aww. I thought that was bigger than last time we were here. Hmm. Well, it's probably a year older. Well, obviously. <laughs> Lots of sheep. Big fluffy sheep. Oh. Very vocal sheep as well. Oh, they yeah. were a minute ago anyway. You've gone quiet now. Yeah, there was very vocal a moment ago. I'm surprised there's no lambs actually. Um, we've seen lambs here before when we've came in this spring. Mm. Yeah, maybe they, they have got... They used to do the sheep racing as well, didn't they? I don't oh, know if they, they still did. do. Yeah, did they yeah. still do it? They used to do it right at the front, didn't they? Yeah, yeah. the sheep racing. Um, and they I'm normally have, oh, maybe the lambs are in the barn. I remember one year actually, the lambs were in the barn, weren't they? The velociraptors in the barn. Yeah, 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 maybe it's eating them. <laughs> <laughs> So since we were last here, it appears they've built a brand new enclosure for the raccoons, which you can see behind us. They are currently up in here. I don't think you can see them because it's too dark, but they're up in the hutch, yeah, um, sleep. keeping out of the rain, which mm. is what most of the animals are doing today, to be honest. The lemurs are all huddled up under the heat lamps. Um, in fact, the lemur wood isn't even open at the no. moment. Probably due to the restrictions. Yeah. yeah. Um, I want also because a lot of zoos are making um, younger ages wear masks in, in lemur enclosures, aren't they? Because yeah. of the transmission. So that's probably why they're doing that. 
Um, but yeah, I like this new little enclosure. Yeah, they like they've got lots of um, enrichment. Yeah. Yeah. And, and look, it's a low a low fence as well, so yeah. adults can see over and big big windows as well. Um, so yeah, a good look at the, the future of the, the type of enclosures that they're probably building here. Um, as you can probably tell, it's still raining. Yeah. <laughs> We've got a coffee to warm us up. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure how good the footage is going to be. And it's probably a short one, guys. I'm sorry about that because um, it's really hard to just get anything because everything's inside um, today, hiding from the rain. Mm. But you know, we'll, we'll try our best. We'll mm -hmm. try our best. And if all else fails, we'll just get lots of shots of the sheep because we know that they are out. <laughs> the sheep are wandering around, they're not bothered by the no. rain, no. So here we are, look, here we're by the lemurs. You can see they're all cuddled up under the little heat lamp. I don't know if you can see, oh, it's just hidden, but sort of behind, oh, where, where can you see, there my finger is. Uh, 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 <coughs> this lemur here has got a baby cuddled up with it. Um, I'll see if I can get a shot of it, if it sort of comes out again. Hello, so uh, first of all, sorry this vlog probably hasn't lived up to the uh, the recent standard of vlogs that we've been putting out, but the weather has just, it's just been relentless all day, it's horrible. not giving up. Um, Absolutely horrible. As you can see, like even raincoats haven't managed to protect us from the rain, so um, we've called it early and we haven't really managed to get the shots that we'd like to, but um, there's nothing we can do about that. Um, we have already got a vlog though, as we mentioned, from Who Zoo back before the rebrand brand when it was Who Farm, where we explored the whole park. So I'll drop the link to that in the description so you can go and check that out. Um, there's much better shots in there of the animals and stuff. Uh, we have got, as we said, um, a trip coming up to Paltons Park. So if you're animal fans or theme park fans, we should get you both covered there because they've got, I think it's mainly rides, but there are some animals there as well. Um, so that's coming up very, very soon. Hopefully that's going to be much better weather and we'll be checking out the new Tornado Springs area, which we're quite excited for, aren't we really? Um, not a park that we've ever been to before, but um, that'll be fun. So subscribe to us to see all that kind of content. We do loads of zoo content 
content, loads of theme park content. So subscribe for all that. Like this video, even if it's just for the effort we've gone to to try and get this vlog out there in this horrible weather. Uh, and as usual, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time we do stuff. Maximum age 12 years old. I think we'll not tell anyone. <laughs>